Hello everybody, Jet here, and um, welcome back to my uh, 12, 12 Medieval Kingdoms play, Total War Medieval Kingdoms 12, 12 AD playthrough, it's, this is a mod for Attila, if you're not aware, uh, link is in the description, um, we've just taken on the Celts over here, and I do need to hang around for a while, annoyingly, and we are building up an army to go and invade the French, um, However, I, I need to get some forces sorted out first. The road system within a region will improve as prosperity. Is there anywhere I can actually recruit troops? Better quality roads increase the movement range of the armies uh. and agents who use them, as well as the line of sight from both the road and the nearest settlement. They so I can recruit in York. I need to bring this army down, to be fair. Ready for battle. Um, I should have started recruiting you up here. It's end turn for now, anyway. Because I have spent all my money. I am about to be sieged in Bordeaux. Um, don't know what the, defense, the defenses in Bordeaux are like, obviously. Um, I'm playing as uh, England, obviously, guys. And uh, we went to war with French, which I didn't realise was going to be dragged me in straight away. That a marriage properly contracted? Yes, I will go into a non-aggression pact. I'm going to go into non-aggression pacts with everybody I possibly can at the moment. Following a new because... agreement... A trade route has been opened. Yeah, I don't care about trade routes. Uh, um, the Fifth Crusade. We will be asked to join. Oh, how do I access diplomacy in this one? Welcome. I want and let us be honoured by your attendance access. and your work. Military access, military access. Military access. There we go. Factions, so I can theoretically sail through their territory, territory uh, without, without diplomatic okay, penalty. Okay, okay, we get that. Okay, they're on plus 15. You can start marching down here. I mean, I can sail over the sea, but I'm probably better to sail through here. Hold this a garrison. So we've got a reasonable income. These guys have an upkeep of 200. Whereas sergeants are obviously substantially cheaper. Uh, mounted knights. They are very good, obviously. Uh, we need good fighters. Sign up, lads, for a good and glorious life. Ah, we're obviously limited to how many of these we Soldiering. can. It's a good life. Come, fight with us. Ah, why well, can I recruit two of those? To serve your people. Hmm. We need we've got more of fighters. them. Come, fight with us. Has missile? Ooh, okay. Are you ready to serve? Quite a few turns worth of recruitment there, so let's do it that way around at least to start with. Okay, so recruitment is a bit slower, but that's to be under understandable. We are still replenishing annoyingly. Can I change this to something where we'll actually get more replenishment? Oh, I can do army recruitment capacity up here. I could if I had a lord. Uh, if I had a lord in place. Oh, they are pulling away from Bordeaux, weirdly. I'm not sure why, because I couldn't really have defended there. We will invade Paris, we will invade France, and remake the uh, 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 Angevin Empire. This is actually a really, really interesting as bit of... As long as our of... remains. No, I don't quite want that. Really interesting bit of history, because at the moment, France, basically... New Pope elected. The, the, the war, reason for the war between France and Britain is very simply that the, um... Hmm. Okay, I can recruit there. We hunger for battle. I want hourly patrols. Set up the watch. Ready for orders. We need good fighters. Come. Fight with us. Start getting some more foot soldiers. No, 
much like you. It's a good life. Okay, they're a bit quicker. Let's get some, some cheapy cav out. And we do have a level up here. In addition to skills gained through okay, 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 I don't care. Uh, start working down here. Recruitment's cheaper. Zeal, public order. Now, this one is actually the best one, I think. Uh, hmm. If there are some military ones down here, there we go. Battlefield movement speed and campaign movement range. So we want to start working our way down to them as early as possible. Oh, I need to up my public order here. We can do that through this. Not through that. Uh, public order is what's needed, to be fair. Yeah. yeah, we still get public order from there. We get... And it unlocks a load of recruitment. Oh, wow. So, yeah, I, I, I'd like a military church, please. Oh, next turn. I think France is at war with multiple factions, which is kind of helping us. We are a proud people and would be no. Anyway, as I was saying, it's a really interesting bit of history this because basically all of these wars, early the early wars between France and England are very simply because um uh, basically after the Normans, obviously William had estates in France and then they married other people in France and basically the English royal family while weren't standing trade partners Develop a healthy respect for each other. Okay, okay, okay. I don't care about this at the moment. Anyway, as I say, so while at, through various good political manoeuvring, the French, oh, God damn them, the um, English ended up Commander. Commander. effectively in charge or effectively um, owning huge chunks of France, um, but not obviously... They owned them, but they weren't in charge of them, if you see what I mean. We're going to sail my armies down to try and make a late naval landing to see if we can beat these guys in. Um, that's really annoying. What do I have here? Can I actually recruit here? No. It's not a... Terrible garrison. It's also not a great garrison, but um, really annoyed by this. Morale while defending. He might well use that. Uh, tax rate, please. Actually, for the governors. Okay, there we go. Ooh, ee, ee, ee. What on earth is going on there? I think I need to pay a bit more attention to my public order, guys, because that's not nice. I am certain hmm. that with your fame nope. wisdom, you. So this one, I've decided, ooh, uh, we will join the Holy Roman Empire. This one, basically, I am going to um, try and reclaim the Ang Angevinian Empire. Um, so Battle France. Um, and then we'll move on to something else. I'm not planning on doing a long playthrough here. I've just realised, do I not have any? Oh, yeah, no, I do. For some reason, the sound disappeared there. For some reason, we're not. The fate of the Andrians, showing himself incapable command of the King of England, must face his ambitious nobles. They have prepared a document which will limit his power. Oh! Refuse to sign, may sign. So Magna Carta. The reconquest of all. A great shame has befallen the House of Anjou. Uh... Uh, the former continental bastion of Norman King's England. Normandy has fallen at French hands. But it's not. So they want us to capture Rouen. The banners of the Angevin float over castles. That's quite cool. Uh, 
to recapture that. Uh, mission issued. Uh, construct a religion building. Yeah. Ready for orders. Forming a blockade. Moving out. The order in which reinforcements take to the battlefield the can be determined now, by lift clicking and dragging units. Sure. In. Let's do a quick save. Because I'm not sure because they were sieging it first. If I hit this, I win. Let's just auto it. Uh, protective stance. Yeah. No, we get it. Yes. Ruan has been captured, which was one of our this missions. Shows event. Uh, was it not? Okay, I don't care about all of these things. Yeah, Imperium level, there we go. Papal favor has increased. Um, because we built a... Oh, we obviously were already building that building. Okay. Where do I actually see my missions? Found an empire. Uh, we need 18 regions. Ask the Pope for money. Ah. Oh, we've recaptured here. We'll see if I suspect this will pop next turn. There you go. Let's start buffing up my armies. Yes. You can sail in here. This panel is used to manually merge armies or fleets in order to assemble the strongest possible force. Click on the unit you wish to move, then click on the tick button to move it from one force to another. It is possible Get some more to select foot knights several units at into here. Docking. Returning to land. Commander. That was a good conquest, and obviously we've upped our army here. All rep replenishment, please. All the replenishment we can get. Ready for I'm going to move the king down to here soon. This is not going well. Even if he's given more public order. It's the squalor. Let's knock that over and get a squalor reduction building going. Your family's political power is determined by two factors. Control and dominion. Your control there we go. Your yeah, yeah, yeah. I, know, I know about all this. Is determined by oh your God, ability he won't stop to talking. resolve political matters and react to other faction events and can be hard to attain. Your dominion over the faction and the people, however... Shut up. We've got squalor here, too. So it's quite a lot of wealth. We're going to chill for a moment. We're not doing too badly. I, I do need to get people down to London, though. London is struggling, and it's that squallow I think, is pulling it down. I respect... I trust you have thought what happened... There we go. Yeah, I'm still not wanting masses of peace with them. Ah, oh, god damn these guys. They need to stop capturing my territory. I'm gonna have to... I'm gonna be forced to do a fast march on Paris now. Because all of these guys have gone to war with me. An uh, offer of peace from us should not be spurned. Now, what say you? I will take their money. Because I'm nothing to do that war. It may annoy the Holy Roman Empire slightly, but I'm not that fussed. We have a noble birth. Parents of John and Isabel have a joyous occasion. We've been blessed with a daughter. A Mongol invasion. Ooh. The Magna Carta, sign. Crisis is averted. However, we lose tax, we gain loyalty. The Council of Nobles meet or refuse. Mm, we will sign. We will sign the Magna Carta just to try and keep everything together. Oh. Yeah, see, that was the issue. So, do we have a squalor reduction building? At your command. 
I don't appear to be able to build that. This is a very, very early thing. So, uh, there are going to be the odd bug. Let's have a look at my technology. Why can't I build that building here? Oh, it's because I've still got a level one building there. I am a dump. I am a noob. I am a noob. Commander. Ready for orders. I really want to have to push straight in here, but. Oh wow, especially as there is an army there. Uh, siege towers. All oh, the siege towers. Besieging the settlement. At your command. Advance. Hopefully they will move forward enough to help us. We can take Paris here. Will be very good. Though those armies are inevitably going to push towards us. Push a bit of extra public order out there. Public order in a garrison from that I am building. I'm certain that with your famed wisdom, you can see that we benefit. Yes, historically, Britain has always been allied with Portugal. It is one of the oldest alliances in the world, actually, Britain and Portugal. As long as our strength. When they join you in a war, a war target can be designated for all your allies. Oh, God damn it! I'm muted. Sorry, I'm not well and I've been coughing. I'll have to check how long I was muted for. The reason I accepted that I pushed on Paris was because, well, we hadn't had much choice. I can't believe this. I don't know how long I've been muted for. I do apologise, guys. I'm still full of cough and cold, so I'm muting to not cough and sniff at you. Um, but yeah, and Portugal, Britain has been allied with for ever. It is Britain's oldest ally, I believe, and one of the oldest alliances in the actu in the world. Okay, there we go. Oh wow, that's an easy auto suddenly. And Paris is falling to the English forces. The Angevinian forces. We hunger for battle. I resisted the urge to sack them. Hmm. Straight on to Orléans next, obviously. Um, this war is going well. It's because they've been sat down there, messing around. Um. I'm going to... A uh, base level copper mine there for the time being. Okay. No. Oh, enemy killed in battle. I don't care. So this is going well. We are going to continue. Oh, no. We will take some time to chill then. Um... Okay. 
Kingdom of Norway is sailing around. But yeah, we are massively advancing into France, but don't get cocky because actually at points Britain did control most of France. At points, the British king, at a certain point, the British king was actually the heir to the French throne, but a usurper took it. I respectfully request the English did kind of force it. I will take their money. And we are definitely going to be full, able to form the Angevinian Empire. Ooh. Do we want to let them marry? We will give our blessing. Ooh, let's have a look at my power. Influence is the accumulated standing of a character within your faction, gradually increased or... I quite like the public order from that, the loyalty. The tax isn't great and the integrity is a little annoying. So you can do things to increase your power. So, secure loyalty, um, gather support. Assassinate other things. My heir there, Sir Richard, is doing nicely. Uh, Oh, my generals. Level him up. Gather some support to try and increase my packs. I don't want to get it too long. Go too low. Um... Your wife can do things occasionally as well. Um, obviously, as soon as he's of age, I want to start getting him doing things as well. We hunger for battle at your command. We've got a lot of good troops here. Let them tower like I think we, we need to keep pushing. I may have rebellions behind me, but... Laying siege to the settlement! March. Waiting for more orders. Gee, the wealth is good from that. And the public order negative is not. Noble, that's good. That's good. Does have a food issue, but how are we doing on food? Yeah, food is absolutely fine. York will fix that shortly. We are doing very nicely. To the higher levels of these, do the areas around them as well. Yes. So I don't necessarily need them everywhere. Oh. City fort, ooh, citadel. No, I want to be able to get all these higher tier buildings, to be fair. Ooh, extra wealth, extra growth. Are there any of these give straight public order bonuses? Not really. No, these are quicker, so... Let's get the Catholic Abbey to start with, because we're a very religious nation and I want to keep the Pope happy. Oh, the French, I think, have finally realised. We are not a friend for the nope. new move. An offer of peace from us should uh... not be spurned. Oh. Now, what I didn't even realise I was all Burgundy. I am not accepting peace with Burgundy. I may vassalise them, but I am not accepting peace with them. The Angevins will rule all of France, and that includes Burgundy, because Burgundy is not actually its own nation. An alliance would truly... No, you're too far away for me to care about. 
Uh, do shout out at me, by the way, at the other people you'd want me to do. Eee, bit of extra control. Yeah, I think if I do it for him, I think that affects us. Another easy auto, because there's no defences. This is getting boring. Oh, and that was the king! That was the French king! Orléans is now... In front in British hands, which again it had been at points. This is kind of quite an apt setup at the moment because this is kind of the point where it was where France started pulling back. Um, but I don't know the exact timings, and I, I think I think we're winning. Yep, I would like a bit of extra armor, please. Okay. I, I do need to have a proper look at these places soon. Um, At your command, we hunger for battle. Look to the defenses. Soldiering. It's a good oh, they take too long to build. Fight with us. Just getting some more spearmen in there, but this is going well. Oh, new tradition. Uh, replenishment, please, again. Replenishment is a really good one to have early on, so. And we are about to start facing actual French resistance. Um... We do need to move an army to Lyon. Um, I think France was more powerful at the point when Britain held all of this, but... Oh, god damn, I hadn't even seen that. Oh, that's a camp. <gasps> There's Norway being pushed out. Is Norway actually a horde in my territory there? There is profit for all in letting our merchants sell uh, in your land. I will land. happily trade with you. Now that we are nearly the Angevins... So yes. That's good. Ready for Ooh, now the question is what do we do? Speak if you must. This option is a formal request to end. This option demands that a faction becomes your puppet <laughs> in a tributary state, taking advantage of your military might in exchange for a percentage of their income and its it was worth a try. At your command. See, I'm tempted to put these guys into Oleon. And march on Leon. Ready for battle. Set up the watch. We cannot follow this order. Uh, okay, we're pulling back there. But France is pretty much done at this point. Obviously, we need to move up to Dijon there. Uh, research raid, please. No, I don't want to do anything just yet there. I know I've got lots of income. I need to have a proper look at my buildings and get all of them sorted. 
We are a proud people. <laughs> That's not happening, because I am going to go to a war friend. with them soon. I, I will want to push down to the Pyrenees. Um, I mean, to be fair, we've got the territory we really wanted here. Uh, we have mm, almost doubled in size here. Um, so it might be time to uh, ally with everybody around us once we deal with the Burgundians. Um, to turn around and consolidate Britain. The people see nope. I was expecting much better defences from France. They you just got their butts kicked. Terrain and settlements that are known a to be birth which you have no line uh, of sight are covered by whatever it takes. Use your agents and yeah, forces to that's reveal annoying. the machinations of your rivals. We did gain more than we lost though. Oh I said that we really didn't. Ew, why is Henry not the heir? Male faction members may also attempt to secure political offices or be assigned governorships. Select a male character, then click on an office or governorship from the appropriate list on the right-hand side of the panel to assign them to it. We hunger for battle! No, we, we can't choose him. Is he used somewhere, or is he just not actually old enough? I think he's just not actually old enough. At your command. Would that I were as swift as the angels. Oh, who are they? Ready for battle. Friends with. They have no allies. Oh, they're a goddamn vassal, though. How about Flanders? Oh, they've got a military alliance for me, that's annoying. And Burgundy is behind there. Hmm. Oh, they're French pretenders down there. Ready for orders. How about these guys? Okay, I can take them on. Commander. March. Waiting for orders. Ah, goddamn. Hang on, I can call them in. Ready for battle. We are going to have a think, and it will be something for us to do next time, guys. Obviously, I do want to go to war. I am going to have to go to war with the Holy Road Empire at some point if I want to expand east, eastwards. Simply because everything over here is part of the goddamn Holy Roman Empire, because it's huge. Because um, technically they're all members of it, rather than actual vassals of it, and the head would move around. But that will also annoy the Pope, so well, I'll probably capture all of here first. Uh, potentially uh, jump on and take Dijon, even if I have a gap in territory there. And we'll have a proper look at orders. upgrading all of my territory. Let's move you over to Colchester to see what you can recruit there. Ooh, yes! And I want some of these guys, because who wouldn't? Anyway, guys, next time... If I say next time, I'm starting recruiting them now. Oh, very limited amounts. I can recruit three turns to recruit. Uh, poor armor piercing, heavy melee infantry. Oh, wow. We need good fighters. And Templar Knights. Wow. What 
these guys. Oh, of course, it doesn't work. Anyway, guys, uh, that is where we're going to be leaving it for now. As always, thank you very much for watching. I do hope you have been enjoying this. Please feel free to pop any comments in the comments section or jump over to my Discord and say hi. There is a link to my Discord in the comments and the description, as well as links to my Twitter, my Patreon, and my affiliations with Overclockers and Humble Bundle Games. So please check them out. As always, thank you for watching.